welcome back to Jerusalem, to a very important time, Passover. This is the greatest celebration of the year for the Jews. And hundreds of thousands have traveled to Jerusalem in memory of their deliverance from Egypt and to offer sacrifices in the temple. Wow, it's a totally electric atmosphere. I can actually hear the roar of the city all the way up here. Yeah, you totally can. Does it sound like it's coming from the Golden Gate? See if you can figure out what's going on. Gives me a, like, a bit of Assassin Creed vibes. So in a video we did a while back, I said I'm going to start trying out some Christian creator projects, games, comics, whatever you name it, on this channel. And today we're going to be diving right into Bible X's demo. It was a really, really fun experience and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. So if you did, enjoy to leave a like, comment down below what you think of the gameplay and subscribe for more Christian creator projects coverage right here on the explanations. Let's get into the video. And let's play the demo. Bethlehem. Oh, that was quick. <laughs> Work in progress. May not represent final game property of BCC. I need aloud I cry with grief for thee my heart is nearly breaking my land is a dark place the past 20 years has been under the rule of deforce and That's gradually they have abandoned about. Christian values Speak about thy beauty rare till hearts are set afire. Yeah, hey, fully thy servants there. I say, My grandmother once told me that I would find the truth if I seek for it in the right places. She well, gave me a book where the secret was written and told me not just to think about it, but do and speak. My heart can find no comfort. My tears like rivers run. My lamentations bitter or all that has been done. We're not fighting against humans. We are fighting against forces and authorities and against the rules of darkness and powers in the spiritual world. And in that fight, I need help. Help from you. And at the walls I leave, I'm ever Good to see you. Welcome to my headquarters. I spend pretty much all my time here, so we might as well call it my home. You're more than welcome to look around and get familiar with the place before we start. Last year I was disconnected from the state power supply and left to my own devices. After two months of my grandfather's old generator, I made my own power supply out by the stream. Not consistent, very much. What is this? George's, George's garage. Let's get our TV. Exploring. Let's see myself in the mirror. No. I like cooking, but it gets a bit boring just cooking for myself. Maybe someday we can cook something together. Fight the good fight of food. 
Is this dude that T? I wonder if that's a that T. That's pretty cool. What's that? Some relics. I can interact on these though. Go upstairs. I want to see upstairs. No, yes. Gotta search every corner. Who's this? Nexile Soda. Right, let's continue the story. I believe this game is based on a time travel. Back to Bible times, from my knowledge. Hey, Hector. Our unit is ready to help you against D-Force. Hey there. I've been waiting for you. I'm just finishing up some final adjustments on the time machine here. I want you to travel back to a very significant event. This is going to be really crucial for us. We're ready. Where are we going this time? We're going to Passover, in the year 33. That Passover? Yes, that Passover. The one where Jesus was arrested and crucified. What he did and said before he did and said this is before definitely work in place, progress. That's I what mean, this was the demo for me. Better understand <laughs> his mission in Jerusalem. This will help us to stand up to the false accusations against our faith here in Terrapolis. It won't be easy, though. Remember, Jesus is not very popular among the Romans and Pharisees, and his disciples will be watching over him carefully. Try to find them and become their friend, and then maybe we'll get a chance to approach Jesus. Hector, I'm excited. Let's get going. Alright, I'm going to turn you into an avatar that should blend right into Jerusalem's culture. Good luck and hold on tight. Enter Elijah, the time machine. So we are going to oh locked in already. Oh. So we're going to time travel it. back to Here the year thirty three. One who commits sin is of the devil, for the devil has sinned from the beginning. The Son of God was revealed for this purpose to destroy the devil's books. John, first John three eight. What does mean? I represent family. Okay, understood. Gives me a, it's like a bit of Assassin Creed vibes. And it was from a year ago, so. My vault. I'm going to Okay, let me speak around here. Time machine stays there. I push over. No. It's a cool day. <laughs> this is so cool. I'm enjoying this so far. 
let me know what you guys think in the comments down below as well okay let me let me follow the path where did the people go new side quest oh, okay. side quest pop up i'm a simple gamer i go do side quests before the main quest Hello, what's wrong? Hey there, would you be able to help me? My father, he went to the town and he told me to watch the lambs. I left the gate open for just one second, but suddenly all of them ran out. Let's catch some lambs. Catch the lambs, how to play? Catch the lambs while the mobile players have distracted them at the food station and return the lambs to the pen. Beware if you if a hungry wolf has taken your lambs, throw stones at it to get from the lambs. <laughs> okay, sad one. The lambs are running around the field. Now and then they will stop to eat at the food stations. Once the lambs are distracted by the food, you can catch them and bring them back to the pen. Okay. Be careful, wolves are in the area. Lambs. If I catch it, how do I catch it? What's a catch point? <laughs> e? E put those on. Do I propel the ship? Ah, catch. Okay, got it. <laughs> Can you return them to? No, oh, that's up. Where's... Ah, up there. This way, lamb. That's one sheep down. Come on, lamb. Ah. Ah. And catch. Friends. This guy is strong to jump with a lamb like you that. You want your lambs? You oh, must stone. defend them by throwing rocks to scare the wolf. Here's the wolf. Yeah. Pick up stones around the area. Hold right click. Uh, I got this. Wait, where's the wolf? Wolf. Ah, oh, wolf. Oh. <laughs> Can I kill the wolf? Did run away. <laughs> ah, another lamp. And three Let's lamps. Catch these lamps before the wolf gets to them. Can I get this lamp? No. Lambs, eat. You are hungry. Yes. Good job. Uh, I hope lambs. Jesus will be in the temple. Maybe we could have a conversation with him. Oh no. Oh no. We lost lamb. Oh no. It hit. Ah, oh, that's dead. <laughs> don't run away, don't run away, don't run away. Ah, missed it. 
Ah, aqui agora. Não, não. Ai, am. Tô lento. Can I not stop it? I can't see. One more lamb, please. And we have caught five lambs. Okay, I'll take it. Not so long. Oh, thank you so much. Ah, oh, you are just as kind as Yeshua, who was here earlier today. Jesus? He was here? You know Jesus? Yes, he is my good friend now. He helped me to feed the lambs. He told me it's very important to take good care of the lambs from an early age. Then they will always listen to the shepherd's voice. And ah, oh, I hope that I will become a good shepherd when I am older. So the lambs will always feel safe. Okay, that was an interesting conversation. Clearly Jesus has taught him what it means to be a good shepherd. Hmm, now I'm good. I want a new side quest. That was fun. Pop the kids. They just disappear. <laughs> Did he see on a loop? And raptured. <laughs> I want a paco. Let's see. Let's see. No. All right. Straight. No. Oh no. What oh, damage exists? Hey Max, look out for the guards. Make sure to hide behind obstacles to avoid their line of sight. You can throw rocks at something that makes noise to distract them. Can I break pots? Okay. The crow. He would beat the AI. Oh, what are the rocks are? Oh, plenty of rocks. Oh, Golden Gate. The Golden Gate is the gate through which Jesus is believed to have arrived in Jerusalem the first time before his arrest and crucifixion. He came with the Mount of Olives. From the Monk of Olives, riding a donkey with the crowd singing Hosanna as he arrived at the city. This was a f this was in fulfillment of the prophecy written in Zechariah 9 9. Rejoice greatly, daughter Zion. Daughter Zion. Shout in triumph, daughter Zion. Daughter Jerusalem. Look, your king is coming to you. He is righteous and victorious, humble and riding on a donkey, on a colt, the, fo the foil of a donkey. Foil. I believe that's how you say it. Foil. 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 <laughs> <laughs> it is also the gate through which Jesus probably exited the city the night of the Last Supper to pray in the Garden of Gethsemane, and the gate he passed through 40 days after his resurrection when his disciples accompanied him to the Mount of Olives, the site from which he ascended to heaven. Cool. Can I crouch? Or see to crouch? Uh, throw rock at. I don't know. Uh, throw rock. Throw rock. Rock not working. Nope. Okay. Oh. Ah. There's someone here. Did I hear something? Need my rock stuff. Don't look in this direction. Don't look. Do not look. Okay, good. Don't look. Nice job. 
Welcome to the <laughs> Temple Mountain Trace, year 33. Now see if you can find some familiar faces around here. So Feel free cool. to explore and pick up some scrolls along the way. Oh, but oops! Don't look at me. Yes. Super, super jump back, oh. Ah, I knew it. We're finally going to get rid of these miserable oh. Romans. Yeah, nor do I, Petros. But I still think we should have paid that farmer for borrowing his donkey. He was born, uh, you know. Relax, Yehuda. That donkey was used for an incredibly worthwhile cause, you know. Yeah, I guess you're right. Oh, wow. Well, that's actually Judas and Peter. Oh. It looks like they're going to exchange some money at one of the booths here. Exchange money? Why? Well, the Jews use Roman coins in Israel these days. But well, those coins have pictures of Caesar stamped on them. And people reckon that's idolatry, so they can't be used in the temple. So oh. the money changes here are actually necessary for the people to be able to make offerings in the temple. Yeah, absolutely. However, the problem is that both the money changes and priests at the temple are taking advantage of the opportunity to make more money out of this business than they should. I'll take this one. <clears throat> a very good afternoon to you, sir. We have traveled a long way, and we're looking forward to a wonderful Pesach celebration in the morning with a delicious Pesach lamb. And of course, we need to pay our temple tax as well. Can you give us a good exchange rate for our Roman coins today? Four to one. Four to one? Mm. But you can't be serious! But last year it was we'll, two we'll, to we'll, one. We will find another place here. It can't have doubled. The way. Hi. Who are you? You're one of Pilate's spies, aren't you? No, no, no. I'm a friend. A friend? <laughs> We've never seen you before. Uh, actually, I know you, but you probably don't know me. And... Max, focus. Okay. What I'm trying to say is that I'm really good at exchanging money at the right rate. And I can help you get a uh, good value for your money. What a scam! So typical! You're one of those okay, wretched then. little... If you're so good, I'll give you a challenge. See if you can exchange this at a rate of two to one. A deal! I'll be right back. <laughs> two to one? You know he'll never be back with that money. He's probably just as slippery as everyone else in this place. I've got a feeling he'll be back. Max right now is messing with the timeline. Go play, exchange money, main to rock, let's play. Units will help you move the table so you can talk to the money chain. Just find the best rate and bring the money back to Peter and shoot us quick. So, okay, let's go. Ah, can I not? Have a friend open by like start on your phone to work. Uh, I shall pause this and go get a sibling. All my siblings are occupied. Not there for the playlist. Solo on my own. Nine. Let's set this to um options video. Okay, good. I said to give to window. And let's switch. Snap left, snap right, because I. Back, go back, go back. Okay, good. I am here. Slide down. Nice. Um, slide down. Oh, slide down. This is so cool. I just don't have anyone to play with right now. Slide down. Slide. Slide down. 
Come here. Walk here, walk here, walk here. Uh, that's last year's price, my friend. Yes. Four to one is my suggestion. Where do we go next? Oh no, we are racing against the clock. Okay, so come here. Alright. What's the next one? Slide up. Up. Down. <laughs> Across. <laughs> uh, Across. I guess that's fine. You can have it for two to one. Um, up. Out. <laughs> this is actually so cool. I actually love that. I just wish you could do it in, I don't know. I like the co-op aspect of it. I mean, one. Hey. Oh, no. Sorry. The resolution Sorry is... it took oh. so long, but... Uh... Here yeah, that's you broke the game. Two to one. Would you take a look at that? As my good friend would say, she's realized in whom. <laughs> uh, very well done. Uh, what is your name again? Yeah, that's my name is Max. Oh, and I. Hey, you stop! No one should be carrying any merchandise through here. Rabbi! Ah, uh, it's him again. Is it not written? My house should be called a place of worship for all nations. But you, to have made it a place where robbers hide. Come on, Yehuda. We have to go. Well, Max. We have to run, but it was nice meeting you. Hopefully, we'll see you around. How dare he bring up the prophecies from Zechariah and Isaiah and all nations? <laughs> we can't just let anyone come in here to worship God. He is creating chaos around right, the whole Zev. city. Zev. We've got to get rid of him. Can I fix my broken game? <laughs> Video. Okay, back to full screen. Yes. Mm, yes. Okay. Quality just went downhill. And 1080p. Wait. 100% resolution scale. Yes. 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 Uh, that's a, that was really, really cool. I really enjoyed that a lot. Jeez, this game has a lot. The only thing that, like, I'm gonna cry because my siblings are busy right now doing just Sunday evening relaxing stuff, so I didn't have anyone to play it with, like, in the moment like that. So I ended up, like, breaking the game. But I really, really enjoyed that. That was, like, that was really good. So. This is the bad oh, this, that music is loud. It is loud. That, that music is loud, loud. It turned on the audio for the disc. <laughs> yeah, so that is Bible X. That was I really like it. Like the time travel aspect. Now you see? As I did when I did our legacy AD review. I'm not gonna do like that harsh in-depth review. But I like the time travel concept of it. I like Superbook a lot. Anyway, how Superbook handles that aspect of it. So, yeah, that's Bible X. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. The link to the download will be in the description down below. You can also build a self plug. We have started our Pilgrim Progress inspired video game project, which will be streaming every Friday at 6:30. Eastern Standard Time, well, Atlantic Standard Time. I'll put it linked. It will also be in the description down below if you want to check this out. This is just 
I want to elevate Christian creative projects and video games and comics. I actually have a really, really cool comic book series. Christian comic book series that I just bought that we're going to cover on the channel. So if you want to see that and more gameplay stuff like Bible Lex. And I'll also be going through the itch.io Christian page to find as much Christian games and just play them more and more to elevate more Christian creative projects rather than continuing to complain about how Marvel and DC and other fictional media is twisting the word of God. So if you guys enjoyed then ensure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe to the explanations for more of this style of content and yeah enjoy the rest of your day, night, evening, morning whenever you see this. Bye bye check out another video that YouTube recommends to you right here. Well, there. You get what I mean. Later.